Hey, what's up? Ben here from blogwithbin.com. And in this video, I'm gonna show you how to quickly and easily embed a YouTube video within a WordPress blog post. Now, if you're new to my channel, welcome. I'm glad you're here. I create full length step-by-step -step video tutorials on how to build, grow, and monetize WordPress blogs. And if you find this video helpful, I would greatly appreciate it if you would like, share, subscribe, or leave a comment letting me know how this video helped you out. I love hearing from you guys, and it means a ton to know that these videos are helping people. Okay, with that being said, let's get started. So for this tutorial, I'm assuming that you already have your blog up and running. If you don't, swing by the Blog With Ben YouTube channel and check out some of my how to start a blog videos. They can help you get up and running in no time. Okay, so for this tutorial, we're going to be embedding a YouTube video within the content of a WordPress blog post. And what does that mean exactly? Well, without getting too technical, all it means is that we'll be adding some code to our blog post that will tell WordPress how to display the video. The great thing about this tip I'm about to show you is that your video will be responsive. And this means that it will look evenly laid out and professional no matter what device the user is viewing the video on. Having a responsive video on your blog post will ensure that the viewing experience stays the same on desktop, mobile, and tablet. This is great for the overall user experience and helps increase important metrics like user engagement and time on your blog posts and pages. So, let's embed a YouTube video. Okay, first things first. You'll want to go to the post that you want to edit and access the WordPress editor. So go ahead and click on Edit Post at the top of the screen. And I should point out that I'm using a demo blog for this tutorial, so the content of the post won't align with the content of the video, but the steps to embed it will be the exact same no matter what. Just wanted to give you a heads up on that. Okay, so to embed the video, you have a few options. But from my experience, the easiest and most efficient way is to use a free tool from the website embedresponsively.com. And let me show you what I mean. So. First thing you want to do is go to YouTube and find the video that you want to embed within your blog post. Then from here, all you're going to do is copy the share link of the video. And to do that, click the share icon at the bottom of the video. And within the pop-up, the default share option will be the link to the video. So all you need to do now is click copy. And you should get a notification that the link has been copied. Next head over to embedresponsively.com and I'll put a link to this resource in the show notes but this free website allows you to quickly create responsive embed code for various types of media. As you can see you can create embed code for YouTube, Vimeo, Daily Motions, Google Maps, Getty Images, generic iframes and they even have some more options as well. It's a super useful tool and I use it all the time. Okay, so for this tutorial, we'll be embedding a YouTube video. So make sure that you have YouTube selected and then replace that default link with the link that we just copied from YouTube. So go ahead and paste that link within the field and then click the embed button. Then the tool will go to work and in a few moments, you'll see a preview of your video as well as the embed code below it. Next, all you're gonna do is highlight and copy the code there and I'm on a Mac, so I'm pressing Command-C on my keyboard to copy it. Then head back to the WordPress editor, and we're gonna be embedding this video at the end of the blog post. However, you can add it anywhere within the content of your blog by leveraging the custom HTML block. So let's add that block. So go ahead and follow the steps to add a new block by clicking the plus icon, and this will bring up your block menu. Then let's search for the custom HTML block, and there it is. Then all you're going to do is place your cursor within the block and paste the code that we just copied from embedresponsively.com. And boom, our video has been embedded. Now, I know it doesn't look like much because this is raw HTML. However, you do have the ability to preview the video within the editor by toggling between HTML and preview within the blocks toolbar at the top of the screen. This gives you a quick preview and visual of how the video will look. However, I always recommend that you preview your work on the front end of the blog before publishing. Each WordPress theme is different, 
and you'll want to make sure that the code is translating correctly on the front end of your site. So with that being said, let's preview our work by clicking the preview button in the upper right hand side of the screen and then select desktop and preview in new tab. And this will take us to our preview environment where we can see what the post will look like before publishing. And as you can see, our embed code from embed responsively is displaying our YouTube video correctly and it looks great. And let's test it out. Perfect, everything is behaving as expected. So let's go ahead and publish our changes and make this live. So back at the editor, to publish this, just click the update button. Then let's view the finished product by clicking one of the view post links. And so far so good. Then let's make sure the video works. And voila, the code is translating correctly to the front end of our blog. The dimensions of the video and playback look great. Then one thing I wanna show you, I'm using the Chrome browser. And if you use the developer tools to inspect the element, you can get a preview of what this will look like on a mobile device. And as you can see, our video is responsive and it looks and behaves the same when viewed on a mobile device. Once again, having video media within your content is a great way to diversify your content and engage with your audience. Plus, the free tool Embed Responsively makes the process worry-free and super easy to implement. So that's gonna do it for this video. If you found it helpful, I would greatly appreciate it if you would like, comment, share, and subscribe to the Blog with Ben YouTube channel. As always, your support means a great deal to me and my family, and for that, I thank you. So thanks again for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.